The Recommended Voluntary Prayers Muslims are required to offer only five prayers a day. However, Islam encourages them to offer other recommended prayers, for doing so makes them worthy of Allah's love and serve to make up for any deficiencies in the performance of the obligatory prayers. The following are some of the most important supererogatory prayers. 1. The supererogatory prayers accompanying the obligatory prayers. As Sunan Arawatib. These are the prayers that are offered before or after the obligatory prayers, and Muslims generally do not neglect them. Regarding the reward for performing these prayers, the Prophet said, Allah will build a house in paradise for any Muslim who prays twelve units of voluntary prayer during the night and day. Sahih Muslim, 728. They are as follows two units before the Fajr prayer. Four units before the Dur prayer, reciting the Taslim after each two units, and two other units after the Dur prayer, two units after the Mahrud prayer, two units after the Isha prayer. 2. The Al Witr prayer. The Arabic word Witr means odd number and refers to odd numbered prayers offered after the Isha prayer. It is considered to be one of the best and most meritorious of all supererogatory prayers. The Prophet once commanded the Muslims, Followers of the Quran, perform the Witra prayer. Sunan at Termidi, 453. Sunan ibn Majah, 1170. The best time to offer the Witra prayer is in the later part of the night before the Fajr prayer, but a Muslim may perform it at any time between the Isha and the Fajr prayers. The minimum number of units for the Witra prayer is one, but it is better to offer three. A Muslim may offer more if he wishes, but the maximum number of units which the Prophet used to perform was eleven. The units of the supererogatory prayers are generally offered two by two, followed by the Taslim. The Witra prayer is no exception. However, if a Muslim wants to conclude his prayer, he must add one single unit, during which he may recite a special supplication known as al kunut supplication. This supplication is recited after rising from the bowing position and before prostrating. After this supplication, he may pray to Allah and ask him for whatever he wishes, holding his hands in front of him with both palms up.